everyone welcome to the woman arise from total woman experience and relationship network we talk about all things relationship and how we're going to help your relationship to grow right babe yeah and just you know we always get questions about you know if you help your spouse instead of controlling them i wanted to address that today we have juicy juicy things for you so stay tuned you know, my name is Angel David Uko, for those who don't know, and your name is? Xavier Okumune. Cut, babe. It's not Xavier Okumune. You gotta put up a sass to it. Xavier, okay? okay. Alright, let's start again. So, my name is Angel David Uko, and you are? Xavier Okumune. Cut, it's not Xavier, it's Xavier. You said it's Xavier. No, no, it's Xavier Okumone. Do you think the name's really going to make a difference? Yeah, it does. Like, you want to be able to attract the right response, like the right people. For sure, it's about the Holy Ghost. Yeah, I'm not saying the Holy Ghost does not help. I'm just saying that sometimes we can do stuff to also help, the, you know, help no as worries. well. No worries, babe. Let's okay. do your way. Go on. Let's try it again. My name is Angel David Oko. And I am Javier Okumone. Cut. I'm sorry, babe. I know that I said it before, but I forgot to add. It's Uko. Oh. Because not everyone's going to remember Ukumune, but you can do Uko. Do you understand what I'm saying? Oh, okay. okay, let's do it again. Okay. Hi, my name is Angel David Uko. And I'm Javier Uko. Yes, perfect. And so we're going to be talking about how you can help. So the first thing you want to do is you want to allow them to be themselves. Right, babe? Absolutely. You do not want to control what who they are as a person or trying to make them, you know, like you, right? You want them to express themselves. Do you have anything else to add to that? Absolutely. I mean, you said it all. No, no, babe, cut, cut. It's not absolutely you said it all. You have to add more things. Like, what else can we do to actually help them? Okay. I'll head with that part out. Okay. okay? Absolutely. You know, it's important for a woman to have a strong fellowship with the Holy Spirit and to have strong communion with the Holy Spirit so that she can be guided by the Holy Spirit. That's so good, babe. Cut. But you know what's it's, a, it's important that ladies be led by the Holy Spirit. Cut. I don't know ladies. You see women. Because women, mm. like, they feel more mature. Because right. ladies feels like a youngish, but we're talking to, like, everyone to use women. Okay. Especially for the strong women, right? They want to mm. feel, they might not want to hear ladies. The so. strong women that are helping their husbands. They're not exactly controlling their not husbands. controlling or wow. trying to make them, woo, you know, yeah. like them. Totally so understand that. Yeah. Okay, yeah, mm. fine. Go on. Okay, so go ahead. Absolutely. It's important mm. that uh, ladies are uh, led by the Holy Spirit. Women. Okay. Yeah. Women are led. Okay. It's it, absolutely. It's important that women are led by the Holy Spirit, have strong fellowship and communion with the Holy Spirit, mm. so that they can be guided in every path of their life, especially when it comes to helping their husbands, not controlling their husbands. Right? You should not control him. Let him be himself. Let him express himself the way he wants to express, especially if he's not hurting you, right? Yeah. Or hurting God, you know? So, yeah, that's really good. Anything else you want to add? Yeah, absolutely. I love the way you said it, babe. You know, self-expression is so important. In fact, to be honest with you, you said so many things that are pertinent for this uh, video. So... I would say that including, you know, how they say their name as well would be part of self-expression. Right. That. I'm so glad that you said that because yeah. if he wants to say his name, just let him say his name the way he wants to say it. It's part of how you just, you don't control. You just want to help and guide, right? I'm so glad that you're here watching this. Stay tuned because we have much more coming up. God bless you. Bye. Bye. No, no, you have to say bye as like we're more possessed. You know what I'm saying? Bye like that. You say bye like that. Okay, God bless you. Bye. Bye. No, no, that's the feminine. Just kind of like, just use your, just bring your voice and be like, bye. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay. yeah. Okay. God bless you. Bye. Bye. That's much better. See? The female. Like, I don't know how Genesis I feel. Genesis chapter 3, verse 16. The NLT version. The Bible says, God said to the woman, you will want to control your man. You will want to control him. 
Uh, but the man will rule over you. Mm. For a man to rule over a woman is a chaos. And for the woman to want to control, to have that desire to control, is also a chaos. A woman by nature is naturally wired by creation of God to want to help or to help a man. But this can easily become controlling tendency or be perceived and as controlled by the man. So, ladies, you will need the help of the Holy Spirit Amen. to be able to help your man in a way it will be appreciated and valued. Amen. So, today, give your heart and your life. Surrender your life to Jesus Christ. Amen. And receive the help of the Holy Spirit that has been given to us freely. Amen. Amen. Relationship. Network. Network. 1-705-426-7353. God bless you.